What's going on, Infinite Fam? Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell, leave a positive comment down below for a chance to get a post notification shout out at the end of today's video. So Janice is currently walking blooper outside. I don't know why, because I insisted on taking him out. It's like 35 degrees outside, God bless her. So I don't know if you guys remember a couple of videos ago, Janice tested me to see if I was basically a gentleman or not. And one of the things that I did in that video was pay for her meal as a boyfriend should. A boyfriend should always pay for his girlfriend's meal. It's just the right thing to do. But today we're gonna be doing the complete opposite. So this morning when we got up, I told Janice said we should go to Panera Bread. Yes, shocker, it's not Chick-fil-A, I know. So I told her we should go to Panera, get some breakfast, and then head over to Starbucks to get some drinks. And of course, she 100% agreed to it, but what she doesn't know is that when we get to the drive-thru, I'm not gonna pay for her order, and she's gonna be completely upset about it. I already know, you guys know how Janice is. She's gonna feel like that's rude, like why are you treating me like that, so on and so forth. So yeah, guys, this one's gonna be a savage video. It's gonna be kind of rude. I'm gonna be kind of sad myself because I don't wanna see Janice upset, and she's probably gonna catch feelings over it all, but you guys already know how it goes down on Team Isaiah, so if you guys are ready for today's video make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button and let's get into it What's going on, Infinite Fam? Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell, leave a positive comment down below for a chance to get a what? For a chance to win a shout out in the next video. That is right, guys. So, today we're having a chill vlog day. We're going to be chilling with some friends later tonight. We're going to have some food, some drinks. It's going to be a good time. You know what I thought about? What? It's actually a weird day. It's a, it's a Monday, and we're going to have like food and drinks with our friends and stuff like that. Well, it's like the only day that our friends are available and we're available, yeah. so let's just Whatever. do it. But we're going to be vlogging throughout the day. We're going to go get some Panera bread. Shocker, mm -hmm. right? Not Chick-fil-A, right? So we're going to go get some Panera bread. We're going to go get some Starbucks. And then we have to head over to my mom, do a couple of like Christmas decorating things in her living room. So we'll vlog that out for you guys. And then we'll bring it back home when we're having food and drinks with the friends. Yes. And that's pretty much how the day is going to go. I guess Panera bread. Wow, that's feels so. That's weird saying that. Panera, actually, I put Isaiah onto Panera. When I used to work in the mall, I used yeah. to eat Panera every single day. And I used to tell Isaiah, like, you have to try it. He's like, no. Because she now. some weird stuff like oh tomato soup and all that. I don't want no dang tomato soup. Tomato like, soup is not weird. You're the only person who thinks that that's like I know a it's crazy not thing. weird. I know it's not weird. I know it's not a crazy thing, but tomato soup to me, me and tomato soup, we don't mix. I don't like tomato soup. Yeah, because he doesn't want to try tomato soup. I tried all right, we're not gonna get into this. Anyway, I just want the grilled cheese from there, all right? And then I want my should I get a coffee at Starbucks? I feel like that's nasty. Coffee and grilled cheese. Then. That's not that nasty. I don't know, it might mess up my stomach. I don't well, know, we're gonna find to out. You. We're gonna find out. What Without further ado, let's go to Panera Bread. Hi, can I have a whole grilled cheese? What do you want? Bacon. Do you want what? Chocolate. What was that? No, just, uh, give me one second. What do you want? I just want chocolate chip bacon. Did you bring your wallet? No. I'm not paying for it, though. Hey. If you didn't bring your wallet, I'm not paying for it. I'll just sell you. No. Hey, just order it. I'm not. Did you, you didn't bring your wallet. Okay, just order it. Just order it. Just order whatever. Alright, that'll be it. Thank you. What the hell was that about? That was kind of embarrassing. How is that embarrassing? You're acting like he could. Pause, first of all, and why are you like not ordering me stuff? Because you didn't bring your wallet. We're going to talk about this after we get your food. There's nothing to talk about. Yes, there is. That's so messed up. You literally didn't order me anything. Here you go. Yep. What? You didn't order me anything. Thank you. That's so... Well, Babe, there's nothing to talk about. Yes, there there's is. Nothing you to seriously talk about. just no, embarrassed me no. in front of that guy. First of all, How did you I got me upset. Here we go. What do you mean? Here we go. Why? Why are you not ordering me stuff? I literally all I wanted was a bagel. It was like two bucks. Just because I don't have my wallet, you don't want to get me something. Is it my Since fault? Since when were we stingy about money like that? I always ordered. Is your it food. my fault? Is it my fault that you didn't bring your wallet? No, it's your wallet. You didn't bring it. That's not my fault. Not okay, my problem. Okay, well, who not said? My problem. But like, that's why are you being so mean? I'm not being mean. I'm just saying you didn't bring your wallet. Why do I have to pay for your stuff if you didn't bring your wallet? I'm literally shocked right now. I don't even know what to say to you because you never do that to me. Now all of a sudden you want to be stingy with your money. I literally could have zelled you. I'm not being. The bagel stingy, is literally two dollars and twenty nine cents. You can't afford okay. two dollars and twenty nine cents. Then okay. I would have just freaking giving you it okay relax calm down being dramatic now no i'm not because now i'm not gonna eat how are you not gonna eat there's stuff at what the do house you if you go, what if we just house. go back to the house what if we go back to the house and we get your wallet that's so stupid like the, that's not the point the point is you literally just like disregarded me why like, are you like over here so upset like relax 
No, like I never do. I never do that to you. That's just so messed up. You literally. You're just, over here getting emotional about a bagel. You understand that? It's not about the bagel. It's just that I, Babe, I would never we can do go that back. to you. We can go back. Get your wallet and just come That's back. That's the point. It's okay. Why are you forcing me to pay for something when I get you stuff all the time? In relationships, you don't do that. We never have done uh, stuff like that. Are you like penny pinching? Who's penny pinching? No one's penny pinching. Like, I don't get it. Like, you're literally not getting me a damn bagel. All right, babe. But every time we go right, out to babe. eat, I'm always right, ready to pay for you. All right, babe. Don't all right, babe, me. That's so messed There's up. There's nothing to talk about. It is what it is at this point. I hope your grilled cheese is nasty. And I hope they burnt the toast. Wow. Exactly. That's just so messed up. All right, whatever. Okay. I literally could just tell you. She's going to continue. What? I'm Baby, just saying. Baby, it's not my fault you didn't bring your wallet. What do you want me to tell you? Because that's not what I'm mad about. First okay, of all, all right, you just embarrassed all right, all right, me in front of this right, man, and right. now he's probably like thinking we're a toxic relationship. That's one. Well, maybe and then he two, should mind his business, and next time you should bring your wallet. I, that's the solution for both of you. Okay. So there's that. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. So fast forward, we now made it to Starbucks. What's that drink that I usually get? Why do you want to know? Because I want a drink. That's too bad you can figure it out yourself. Okay, something salty. All right, whatever. I don't even know why you're even talking to me right now. Like, you acting like you didn't just completely ignore my order at Panera. Are we back on this again? I'm pissed, honestly. Like, that's, that's just foul. Like, you don't do that. Well, next time, bring your wallet. I don't know what to tell Okay, you. you said that like a million times. All right, I'll bring you're my saying the same thing time. a million times. You're saying the same thing. Like, all right, uh, we, we know what happened. We were both there. That's it. You didn't bring your wallet. It's not my fault. Okay, get over it. Yeah, I, look who's talking. Can you tell me the drink that I usually get now? The warm, the hot one? You should know. White chocolate mocha. That's it. All right, I think I'm going to get that. Okay, good for you. Hi, can I have a grande white chocolate mocha? Grande white chocolate mocha? Was that hot or iced? Hot, please. Hot? Anything else? Oh, oh, oh you didn't bring your wallet. No, that'll be it. All right, it's going to be 560. Thank you. No problem, thank you. That white chocolate mocha about to slap, especially on this cold day. Are you serious? What? I... Don't even talk to me. I wasn't going to say anything. Literally, don't even talk to me. I wasn't going to say anything. <sighs> The fact that you just did this shit to me again? Didn't we just have this conversation at Panera? Like, let's what? not do this again. Let's not do this again. Literally you... just because I didn't bring oh my wallet? My are you serious? Yes, I'm not paying for your stuff. Yes. So is this going to be a thing now? Are you just not going to pay for me all the time? I don't know. Just bring your wallet and we'll find out. What is the point? Why do I have to physically have my wallet for you to offer to do anything for me? Because... It's your stuff, so bring your wallet. Just like how I'm paying for my stuff with my wallet. Okay, but I always pay for your stuff with my money. Okay. And I never complain. Okay. What we're do not, you mean, We're okay? not going through this again. We just did this at Panera. What we're do not you doing mean? This, we're not doing this again. I'm literally going to starve. You, you're you spoiling yourself with there's food Panera. At the house. First of all, I put you onto Panera. Who put you onto Starbucks? Me. Babe, you're giving me a headache. I don't care if I'm giving you a headache. You're giving me a headache. I don't care. You're Too bad. Too bad you're going to hear my mouth because what did you not do? You're not being a good boyfriend right now. That's messed up. Bring your wallet next time. What does my wallet have to do with anything? That's my question. It has to do with your stomach and you buying stuff. If you can't buy stuff, that's probably because you don't have your wallet. So next time, bring your wallet so you can buy stuff. That's just wrong. I'm not buying your stuff. It's just as simple as that. I don't care. I don't need you to buy me anything. Okay, then. So next time, just bring your wallet. Okay, and that's that. Okay, I will. Literally, I'm just going to, whenever you get home, I'm going to hop in the car and I'm going gonna to get my own stuff. By the way, I'm never going to cook for you again. Now, so let's see who's really going to starve. If you want to be petty, we can take it there, seriously, because I'm over this. The worst, the biggest, the biggest turnoff to me is a stingy person. And you're being super stingy right now. I don't know where it's coming from. And keep in mind, Christmas is around the corner, too. What so does that mean? Acting like petty, you're going to get me toys or something. No, what? so if you want to be petty, I had so much plans. Listen, but guess listen, what? Listen, now, listen, if you want to be petty, listen, 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 if you listen, listen, petty, listen, listen, if you want to be listen, petty, we can do that. Listen, you, you... Just said that the biggest turnoff for you is when 
someone is stingy with their exactly. money. One of the biggest no, turnoffs stingy. for me is when someone expects me to pay for their stuff. I'm That's not what, expecting it. Yeah, not yeah expecting you are because you're upset. You're expecting it. I literally said I can sell you. I'm not expecting you to pay for me at okay, all. Well, even I don't, wanna, the I don't want to. Do. I don't want to go through the whole process and of you sending me money. You're literally acting over two dollars. All right, we're done with this conversation. We're done. We just went through this at Panera. I'm not doing this again. Okay, so let's not do it again. So all then right, so then that's it. it. Just ja, that's it. Drop it. Ja, nothing. Like that's it. you're just like so it. messed just up. I'm just not even. Drop it. Just drop it. Drop it and leave it on the ground. Don't pick it back up. All right, whatever. I'm not doing this, bro. Me either. Glad we're on the same page. Finally. So, white, hot chocolate mocha. All right, there, there, there's no need to be salty. There's no need to be salty. Whatever. It is whatever. Where's your Starbucks drink? You think you're funny. That's your... <laughs> <laughs> Babe, I'm joking with you. I'm joking with you. This is a prank. I'm, spe I'm, I'm, I'm spinning. I'm spinning back around right now. I'm doing a whole U-turn. We're gonna hit Panera again right here, and then we're gonna hit Starbucks. This was a prank. I did an intro at the house. I said that I wasn't gonna be paying for your food, even though I said that we should go get food together. This is a complete prank. I would never do you like that. You know that. When do I like not offer to like to pay for your stuff and stuff like that? I would never do that to you. You know that. That's so much stuff. I would never do that to you. You know that. I'm busting a U-turn, we're gonna go get you your Panera, we're gonna get you whatever you want, and then we're gonna go to Starbucks, we're gonna wait on the line again, and we're gonna get you whatever you want, alright? I don't wanna wait on the line again, I'm starving! It's alright, it's alright, I'm gonna get you whatever you- uh, eat my grilled cheese! No, I don't want grilled cheese! You don't want the grilled cheese? No, I didn't want a grilled cheese, I wanted a cinnamon bagel or a chocolate chip bagel. Well, Panera doesn't have a line, so you're gonna eat pretty quickly. Fine. Yeah, yeah, you happy now? You happy? Can you say that was mean. Can you say Team Isaiah? No. <laughs> Why not? Cause that was mean. Say Team Isaiah. You know it was a good one. Come on, give me the credit, bro. Give him the credit where it's due. I'm not saying that. Give the credit where it's due. Fine, it was a good. Come on, one. give me a fist pound. Give me a fist pound. Yeah, that's right. That's right. You gonna switch over to this time? What are you talking about? You gonna switch over to Team Isaiah? No. I feel bad for you and your team. You it's gotta buy week. me dinner tonight too. Well, I'll buy you whatever you want. Okay. That's right. Give me a ring. <laughs> Can I have a cinnamon crunch bagel and what spreads do you guys have? We have cream cheese, honey, walnut cream cheese, thyme and onion cream cheese, and butter and cheese. I'll get the, the honey walnut cream cheese. Can I have the honey walnut cream cheese with that? Okay, would you like it toasted with the bagel? Yes. Yes, please. Okay, anything else? Yes, That'll be all. Let me figure it Thank you. Told you I got you. Thank you you happy now? Yeah, literally three dollars and eight cents. Give me kiss. Give me. Love you. I love you. You know I would never do that to you. I. Uh, oh, you know go. I would never do that to you. When yeah, have I like, ever done that to you? That's what I'm saying. Like I don't know. You woke up on like I don't know. You woke up on the wrong side of the bed today. Like I would never do that. I would never like anyone. I would never like have them not eat. Like I would yeah. give you. I would give them my food before I let them starve. I know. Guys, Isaiah's the least stingy person I know. Yeah. So, like, the fact that he just did that to me, I was so pissed. Guys, if I literally only have, like, a dollar in my pocket and that's all I have to my name and you ask me for it, I will give you the dollar. Just because that's just the way I am and that's the way I was raised. But, yeah, I would never do that to you. So, now we're going to go to Starbucks. We're going to get your drink. Do you know what drink you want? I just saw a drink on, <laughs> on Instagram. It's a sugar cookie hot chocolate. I'm going to put you guys on. So, if you want one... You ask for a white hot chocolate with two pumps of sugar cookie syrup, two pumps of white chocolate mocha sauce, and two pumps of vanilla with whipped and toasted white mocha sprinkles. That sounds so good. Right? Oh, sounds nice, like a lot of sugar day, though. On a nice cold day. Ooh. Today is cold. It's in the 40s. No, like a, a really, really cold day. Right now it's 47 degrees, it says the car. The fact that it's going to get colder too makes yeah, me it's like scary. insane. Gosh. It could be a lot worse though, because there's people out there that they have like negative 20 degrees, and that's the regular to them. God bless you. I don't know you how you guys deal with that. God bless you. Guys. I can't. This is too much for me right now. Yeah. Look at who's happy now that they got food. Look at who's happy. And... Show, show, show them the bagel. Show them the bagel, so they know I'm not a bad boyfriend. Okay, hold on. So they know I really got you, because I don't want to see no comments like he really didn't get her he food. He got me the bagel. Wait, what the? Why is it like that? I don't know. They literally just gave it to me. It's like ripped too. Okay, well I guess we could tape it. I guess that. 
<laughs> I guess that's why the bagel's only a dollar. <laughs> While we wait on this long line at Starbucks, we're eating our food. And my, I don't know who took the real L here because I pranked you, yeah, but I am the one who has the cold food. I have a cold grilled cheese now because <laughs> I just been letting it sit. So I think I took the L. All right, guys, so we both got our drinks, all right? I would never do my baby girl foul like that. You guys should know that too. This was a savage prank and I told them that I was gonna feel bad. I don't know if I said that, I think I might have, but I did feel bad doing this because I would never want to like do you foul like that. I would never want to see you upset and stuff like that, so. Well, I'm happy now because this yeah. hot chocolate is everything. You got your hot chocolate, you had your bagel. You good? Mm -hmm. we, we good, we square? Yeah, you're getting your dinner later. That's fine. I want ramen. That's fine. Okay. Mm. All right, guys, so that is it for today's Oh, by the way, we're not vlogging today. Yeah. Anyway, guys, that is it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys... <laughs> if you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button. Comment down below, Team Isaiah, all day, every day, because, yo, my team be coming with the bangers. I'm like, get team. But anyway, time for today's post notification shout-out. Today's post notification shout-out goes out to... Angela Rodriguez, thank you so much for your love and support. Isaiah and I love you. If you want a post notification shout-out, all you guys got to do is like, comment, share, and subscribe. And turn your post notification bells on so you're notified whenever we post a new video. Also, show mad love on the Instagram accounts, okay? Because we do be getting some post notification shout-outs from there, too. Yeah. Not gonna lie. We would say, like, half of them come from Instagram. Mm -hmm. But with all that being said, guys, we'll see you guys in the next video.